hi everyone i just thought i'd take a few minutes to um, do an update video on the constellation circle that we had in october ahead of our next constellation circle which is next thursday the 16th of november at 7 pm and we'd love you to join us if you feel that it is work that would be helpful for you so the last circle was really wonderful there was six of us um, that joined and let me just explain how it ran so that if you're thinking about joining you've got a better idea of what happened so out of that six people that signed up one person um, had volunteered as our first issue holder so before we met as a group I spent an hour with that person hearing about why they felt drawn to do this work and together with me asking questions about her current situation and what she really wanted to get out of the session we built a hypothesis that we then agreed we would take to the constellation circle and set up using the other members of the group as representations for different parts of her system and one of the things that became really clear when I was um, talking to her was that her main motivation was to see if there was anything that we could do to support her daughter with the current challenges that she's facing. Whenever I hear that somebody's daughter or son is struggling to interact with life in the way that they really want to, I'm curious about whether that son or daughter is making up for something that hasn't quite resolved itself within the family system. So it drew me to ask quite a lot of questions about the issue holders, family of origin, um, her birth story, anything that would help me understand what is missing from this family system that this um, child is attempting to make up for in a distorted way, in a subconscious way that is now impinging on their ability to really step into what life wants of them. And there was something that showed itself as a possibility that we agreed that we would investigate. We brought the group together uh, for a few hours on the Thursday evening and people were willing to step into that constellation and offer themselves as representatives for the client's system so that we could bring in elements that for good reason had been uh, kept out of that family system. My hypothesis was that the family's understandable decision to keep certain people at a distance was have, taking its toll on the very youngest, most vulnerable members of that system and that unbeknownst to, to them, they were doing what they could to raise the alarm what we understand about family systems is that they want to complete themselves and when they can't complete themselves because somebody's not being allowed to take their place it's the very youngest members the most vulnerable members of that family system that are like the canaries down the coal mine they will be showing us the signs that say something's missing here and I'm doing my best to try to cope with that, but it's too hard. And so as we put those elements back in that had not been allowed their place, we saw immediately the impact and we felt immediately the impact on the representatives that we were using for the youngest members of the family. And we also saw it in the representative for the issue holder herself. It was a really beautiful piece of work and I'm truly grateful to everybody that showed up and played their part in it. 
and of course to the issue holder for having the courage to be the person that stepped forward. Um, since then, um, there's been a chance to catch up with how people have been doing. And as usual with constellations, even those people that weren't the issue holder um, were given a gift of insight or connection um, that comes from the work that they did and how that links to their own family system and what they're currently um, carrying or curious about. So hopefully this will uh, give you a better idea of how we're holding these circles and what we um, are using that time for. If you'd like to know more, then you can just drop me a line. I'd love to, to hear about your questions and help you um, understand the, the process um, a bit more, if that's helpful. If you'd like to be an issue holder or you'd like to join as a representative, then um, the links are in the email and they're in circle. And it'd be great to have you along to the next one in November. Thanks very much. Bye.